The superconducting nanowire single photon detector SNSPD is a type of near-infrared and optical single photon detector based on a current biased superconducting nanowire. It was first developed by scientists at Moscow State Pedagogical University and at the University of Rochester in 2001. The first fully operational prototype was demonstrated in 2005 by the University of Rochester, the National Institute of Standards and Technology Boulder, and BBN Technologies as part of the DARPA Quantum Network. As of 2018, a superconducting nanowire single photon detector is the fastest single photon detector SPD for photon counting. Topic principle of operation The SNSPD consists of a thin approximately equals 5 nanometers and narrow approximately equals 100 nanometers superconducting nanowire. The length is typically hundreds of micrometers, and the nanowire is patterned in a compact meander geometry to create a square or circular pixel with high detection efficiency. The nanowire is cooled well below its superconducting critical temperature and biased with a DC current that is close to but less than the superconducting critical current of the nanowire. A photon incident on the nanowire breaks Cooper pairs and reduces the local critical current below that of the bias current. This results in the formation of a localized non-superconducting region, or hotspot, with finite electrical resistance. This resistance is typically larger than the 50 ohm input impedance of the readout amplifier, and hence most of the bias current is shunted to the amplifier. This produces a measurable voltage pulse that is approximately equal to the bias current multiplied by 50 ohms. With most of the bias current flowing through the amplifier, the non-superconducting region cools and returns to the superconducting state. The time for the current to return to the nanowire is typically set by the inductive time constant of the nanowire, equal to the kinetic inductance of the nanowire divided by the impedance of the readout circuit. Proper self-resetting of the device requires that this inductive time constant be slower than the intrinsic cooling time of the nanowire hotspot, while the SNSPD does not offer the intrinsic energy or photon number resolution of the superconducting transition edge sensor, the SNSPD is significantly faster than conventional transition edge sensors and operates at higher temperatures. Most SNSPDs are made of niobium nitride NBN, which offers a relatively high superconducting critical temperature approximately equals 10 K and a very fast cooling time. Topic. Applications Many of the initial application demonstrations of SNSPDs have been in the area of quantum information, such as quantum key distribution and quantum computing. Other applications include imaging of infrared photoemission for defect analysis in CMOS circuitry, litter, on-chip quantum optics, fiber optic temperature sensing, single plasmon detection, quantum plasmonics, single electron detection, single alpha and beta particles detection, singlet oxygen luminescence detection and ultra-long distance classical communication. A number of companies are commercializing complete single photon detection systems based on superconducting nanowires, including Single Quantum, Photon Spot, Sconfoton, Scontel, Quantum Opus, and ID Quantique. Wider adoption of SNSPD technology is closely linked to advances in cryocoolers for 4K and below, and SNSPDs have recently been demonstrated in miniaturized systems.